The most common type of continuously variable transmission, or CVT, operates on a variable diameter pulley system with three basic components. A drive or input pulley that is connected to the crankshaft of the engine, a driven or output pulley that transfers energy to the drive shaft, and a belt made of pieces of metal held together by thin stacked steel bands. Each pulley consists of two 11 degree cones which face each other. The belt rides in the groove between the two cones. The diameter of each pulley varies as one of its two sides move closer together or farther apart. As the two cones of one pulley move closer together, the two cones of the other pulley move apart. This continuous action keeps the belt clamped and allows for a wide range of gear ratios, from high or first gear to low. As the pulley sides pull together or push apart, the groove for the belt widens or narrows, varying the diameter at which the belt rides on the pulley. This diameter determines the gear ratio. When the belt rides lower on the driving pulley and higher on the driven pulley, the rotational speed of the driven pulley decreases, torque increases, and results in a higher gear ratio. When the opposite situation occurs, the rotational speed of the driven pulley increases for a lower gear ratio.